Oh, what now? Grayson, there seems to be a portal to a different dimension in our living room. Yeah, I see that. How is that possible? Do you really expect me to have an answer? Ron, you don't need to give me the attitude. Because I do. Oh. I accidentally threw salt at the wall and unintentionally tore the fabric of space and time. Through, like, witchcraft? What? But I don't know. You said salt, so I'm like, okay, uh, witch witchcraft? Crystals. Think I do witchcraft? I don't know, Ron. I don't know what you're into. How exactly did you do this then? Well, what I was trying to say before I was rudely interrupted. Oh my god. I believe the salt at a microscopic level split between possibly ions causing some fourth dimensional time fissure between dimensions. Or in this case, a room. A room? Well, isn't that what a room looks like to you? So there's just a dimension that's just a bunch of rooms? Why does it smell like wet carpet? I would imagine. What was that? I think it's about time we close this. Why? Did you really just ask me that after hearing what that was? Well, why the urgency? What was that? Considering this may be a different dimension, I imagine the human mind can't even comprehend it, and I care not to find out. Ron? That's not good. Ron, what do we do? Maybe it expects an offering. Ron! Not you, Grayson. Give me your cup. But I love this coffee cup. Throw yours in. I just bought this cup. Why would I do that? Fine, take it. Ron, it's getting louder. Shh. Was that a chair? I think that was our old one. Which reminds me, we need to pick up new furniture at Ikea. Oh. Well, I got a new coffee creamer if you'd like to try it.